Hey, this is Kevin, my two cents worth today. Consistency in the golf swing, no matter what club you're swinging. That's right, whether it's a seven iron, five iron, hybrid. There was a golf professional many years ago, Al Geiberger. And if you watched a video of his swing, it was beautiful. It was just motion that was similar, whether he was swinging a driver, swinging his five iron, swinging his wedge. So we've been talking about a number of swing elements that I think have to remain consistent in order for you to have good solid contact each and every time. You're not going to hit it perfect, this is a game of misses. So let's just go over a couple of those and let's demonstrate maybe, hopefully, how a 7 iron swing doesn't really differ that much from a hybrid swing. So I approach the game with, a, with an open stance. Um, it, it just is something a little bit easier for me. I'm not going to get involved with the big shoulder hip turn. I'm going to keep that club kind of in front of me and as I bring it back I'll get that shoulder turn and then I work it through. I'm going to work through a firm left side, kind of that shut the door hinging element. What's key for me is being able to set it against a right firm right side where my right foot is planted. I don't let that weight roll over the right. I stay on the inside. I get it set up here and then I just release it through. And if I'm releasing it through or if I'm swinging it through and not making this motion but making this motion I have great opportunity for success so let's see let's take the seven iron see if I can't make the swing I'm speaking of not bad let's take my hybrid See if I can make the same type of swing and get the great contact. A little wider stance, a little longer club. That'll play anywhere. Check my tips out at crescentputtingtrainer.com. That's one word, crescentputtingtrainer.com. See you next time.